right, baby, where are we going today? Vamos a ir a Playas de Tijuana. My first time, and how long has it been for you? Yo tengo como unos tres, cuatro años que no voy para allá, así que... Yeah, three or four years, so sí, I've heard a lot's changed since then, so... Right now, it's 22 minutes from Zona Rio, and we're driving through the ghetto right now. We're driving through Zona Norte. Here, Actually, yeah. Stop it, turn the camera around real quick. And see, we're driving through. It looks a little Sunday market where they don't look where they're going. They just walk into the middle of the road. But uh, this is actually kind of cool. I'm surprised it's like a little tapito, but without the knockoff main brand stuff. So I, I won't be here then. <laughs> Along the border, uh, west to Playas de Tijuana, we're gonna go to what's called Malacón. And from there, I think they have much shopping. We're gonna walk the boardwalk and we'll tap in with you guys in about, we'll go these bikes in about 15 minutes, okay? See you guys soon. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. So now we are on the west side of Zona Norte and it's not necessarily ghetto, but it's um, when you're in that Zona Norte area with uh, like the strip clubs and HK and all that, it's just a lot of rampant drug use and prostitution. So it's like, in addition to being um, un, uh, like kind of unsafe, there's a you know high high probability that someone that you run to in the street is going to be cracked out. So there are two ways you can get to Playas from Zona Rio. I mean, two ways that I can see. One is along the the border, which is pretty much a straight shot um, east to west. But we're going to go down a uh, Benito Juarez the second, and it's a. Uh, I'm not sure if it's faster or if it's um, <coughs> if there's construction during the gate, but that's what the GPS is telling me to do, so I'm gonna take it. These are the demographic of area we're in right now. If it gets really extreme in one direction, either it's super nice or super ghetto, I will log back in. Oh shit. Interesting view, looking to the coast from Mexico over the border through a valley. Not going to Rosarito or Ensenada, going to Playas. Wow, hold on, can I zoom in here? Wow, okay, cool. Hopefully I don't crash. Oh, that's kind of cool. US views coming in. Looks like there's a big old monument of some sort or a coliseum, looks like. Oh yeah, more in a second. All right, we just put the car in park, but we just got to the main strip. Like you can see there's a Coliseum or something right here. And in front of us is the gate, which they've beautified by painting it gray. And you can see like the no man's land in front of it. And then the other gate for the US. And then it's home free. <laughs> just kidding. But we got really lucky as we were pulling out, somebody was, or we we're pulling in, someone was pulling out. So I just swooped into their spot. And I can tell this is a spot that is very difficult to park. Apply us the Tijuana. We're in the back of that Coliseum, so we got really lucky. Let's go walk around. All right, so we are here, and the only thing I can think of right now is how I'm gonna hop this. Because people who say they can hop this, no, dude, this thing is tall. It's gotta be 30 feet tall. And then they have like, so you can't climb it up it because it has this. I mean, I can see if you throw a rope over somehow and loop it, but it looks like there's some protective measures on the back here too. Let's take a better look at this fence actually. All right, so the fence goes out into the water. So wait, can we just swim around it or what? We've got to figure that out when we get there. It looks like there's deported artists. And then, oh, this is kind of sad. Wow, this guy has multiple photos here. If you guys have seen any of these people? <laughs> Please, it's not funny. What are you laughing at? What are you laughing at? <laughs> and then there's a lighthouse here. Let's keep walking. This is a walking tour now. All right, what are you thinking? Stephanie, what are your thoughts? Limite de la República Mexicana. Aquí termina México. Wait, what? So this is like public land or what? Huh? Tierra pública? Aquí? No, 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 bebé. República Mexicana. México. Limite. What's limite? Limite is como aquí termina. Como end. It ends here? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, what is this right here? La destrucción. Oh, going okay. this way. I'm dumb. Okay, going this way. I thought it was like public land on the beach. That's the real estate side of me. <laughs> okay, yeah, going north, that makes sense, okay. Wow, I feel really smart after that one, huh? Me siento inteligente después. Don't touch that, it's electric, electric. <laughs> okay, wow, this is cool. This is the little, uh, we call it, baby, ¿cómo se llama este lugar? Moyacan, Telecan. Ah, el... Malacón. 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 Good, baby, your Spanish is good. <laughs> 
Oh, this is a one way. Or this is a dead end. You want to go this way? Bro, that little dog is going to. I want a dog. Between that dog and the, and the car alarm, I don't know which one I'm going to do. Kill first. <laughs> Just kidding. All right. There's the dolphin statue here. And first look at the pier or at the beach. Let's actually get a better look over here. And yeah, dude, if you want to go into the U.S., you can just swim around right there. Wow. Okay, looks like there's a little gym here. Do some pull-ups. This is where I would cross right there. I got, you got to swim right out here. And then it's nothing but smooth sailing once you get across. Hi, baby. But yeah, let's go explore. I don't know if I'm gonna make it back onto the beach, so I don't know why I brought the football. But I might hit some pull-ups. Hola, Okay, gente. so we came to a fork in the road, and, it, and I guess it's a loop, so we can decide if we want to go around to the right along the water, and then loop back around on the main street, or loop on the, go on the main street, loop back around on the water. What do you think we should do? Vamos para acá primero. Okay, let's go. Maybe we find food? Or is there food everywhere? Everywhere. Okay. Pero... Wait. Okay, see, look, there's already food here, hot dogs. Let's go. Okay, wait for something good. So, if you'll notice, I put on the windbreaker for the microphone because it is very windy out here. And there's a banda, banda. And I'm sure we're going to see a lot of little tiendas. <laughs> so, we've now been to Guadalajara, Mexico City, Tijuana. I now know the prices of like, ahora yo sé los precios de cosas como anillos y. Pulseras, so I'm not gonna get gringo today, okay? <laughs> so I know that you could find sunglasses or rings or necklaces for like 100 pesos or less, okay? So if I, I'm not gonna pay anything over that, maybe. We'll see. Unless she likes it a lot. <laughs> wow, okay. I already know we're gonna find a lot of good stuff here. I said, podemos tomar y caminar. No hay problema. We got here durazno queso. Oh, 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 let's go. Uh, restaurantes. Oh, so sweet. You want one? <laughs> oh, wow. We were looking for a cafe that Stephanie went to five years ago. We found one on the water here. Here's the view. Um, but she asked the gentleman inside and he says, he thinks the one that she's talking about closed down two years ago. So tell, us, tell us what you know uh, about the other cafe. What was so special about the cafe? It's special because I had venido with my friends here for like three or four years. Entonces, Tiene bastante que no vengo y ahí fue a donde donde fui y quería ir otra vez pero ya creo que ya lo cerraron y estoy triste. It's okay, we're gonna get a crepa <laughs> y a couple coffees, matcha. Y ya then... me puse el suéter porque me dio frío. Es que hay mucho viento. It is mucho viento. And then we're gonna go find some some. We gotta keep her focused because she said she wants a cocktail mariscos, but then we walk by a restaurant. She's like, oh, I want to go now. I say no, she can't go. She goes. So looking north, you can see San Diego here. And see, that's not even too far. These guys are already trying to swim across the border. <laughs> Is that really that there's got to be something like some kind of electrical net or something that makes it so you can't swim or someone monitoring it. How about that? But yeah, this is just like Pacific Beach. It's zero difference. Zero difference. Walking on the Malacón as well. Malacón is pier. We're walking on a, I guess, boardwalk. Is it the same thing? We're gonna find uh, es tiempo para comida? Okay. Yes. Okay, because I'm tangoing hombre. <laughs> right now, right about now. Someone's about to get it. This elote man's about to get it. <laughs> Here's a view of the beach where people hang out. It is pretty crowded. That looks like it's very rocky right there. And you've got kids drinking, parents drinking. I'm not drinking. People selling alcohol. 
I don't know, man. I think the beaches in San Diego might be a little nicer. <laughs> the houses on the boardwalk in San Diego are a little better too. But look at this guy, he's talented. Yeah, I like that. That's good. Muy talentoso. Muy talentoso. Hasta que se seque el malecón. No, just ignore her. Look at these casas. Hey, look at this waterfront casa. Casa waterfront. Okay. Yeah, this is. Where do you guys want to sit? Let's sit on in the on, on the rocks. En la roca. <laughs> hey, donde quieres sentar? <laughs> on the en la roca. No, <laughs> okay. thank you. We have sand, but no. We won't. ¿Cuánto cuesta el pulpo? ¿Cuánto cuesta el pulpo? $150. I want to try. Huh? I want to try. You want, ¿Quieres probar? Okay. Okay, I guess. All right, they're hitting the pulpo with... Uh, ¿Qué tipo de salsa es esta? Es adobo. 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 Okay, okay, good. Beach front, pulpo, de... Pulpo de dónde? De dónde? Pulpo de playas de Tijuana. Es muy, muy rico. I'm scared. Stop. Okay, háblame. Hola, aquí le vamos a poner limón. Para mí, por favor. Por favor. Por eso, un poco habanero. Okay. Un poco, poco. Oh, you finished it, it was good. ¿Cuál? ¿Este de aquí? Este. Oh, ¿es este? Sí. You can, puedes quitar uno de este uh, okay. palo, de palo. Wow, wow. All right. No you go ahead, go for it. I want to watch you. Como lo quito así nomás? Wow, look at this. Ay, oh. ay, shit. <laughs> Language, we have kids watching. I'm sorry. Oh. Right. <laughs> Keep it over the plate, you're going to spill on yourself. Rico? Okay. Oh, film me. Uh, what the? You just sucked the guts out of the head. <laughs> All right, my turn. My turn here. Why is it cold? <laughs> okay, I like it. Watch, we're gonna open this whole thing right here. Wasn't worth 150. Actually, maybe it was. It's good. Um, I feel sick. <laughs> oh, yeah. After that pulpo, you know, it's full of protein. You gotta hit the... Oh. Okay, okay, hold on. I don't need to do cardio right now. Oh! Bye. All right, that's enough for now. I just did leg day yesterday, so let's continue walking. Gracias. Here's the bottom view. Now there's a clown. You see him? He's got quite the crowd here. Wow, good for him, good for him. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> bien hecho, bien hecho. Cat in the wild. But check this out. En la playa. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, can we have some, can we have some chips? <laughs> All right, Stephanie, now I'm hungry. Oh, what do we have here? Okay. Oh, mas pulpo. No, 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 otra vez. <laughs> camarón, Stephanie. <laughs> so if you guys want pulpo and camarón, you're in the right place. We were walking on the pier and we saw this restaurant from the bottom, from the pier, and it, it's beachfront and it's looking at the, uh, the ocean, so we're going to hopefully get a good seat with a good view, but it looked like it was a big restaurant. There's actually another entrance over there that goes down to the second ADU, <laughs> to the other part of the building. So this looks like an upfront restaurant and there's a downstairs part too. All right, we are here looking at the menu. Baby got a michelada. I got an agua mineral because I'm watching my figure. <laughs> But this menu looks crazy, look. Everything looks like some straight hitters on here. I don't think we're gonna be able to go wrong here, so. Oh my, 
I told myself I, w I would never do a uh, seafood boil in front of a girl, but we might have to make that change right now. Or tacos. Where's the tacos at? Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna just try a couple camarón. I think I always like camarón better. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. Starting now. Hola chicos, cómo están? Pedí una michelada con una ultra escarchada de tajín. Está deliciosa. Deliciosa. Okay, and I love when restaurants give you a little bit of fish juice salsa and chips. That's how you know it's gonna be a banger restaurant. And I'm gonna go dos camarón and dos un de marlin. ¿Qué vas a pedir? Creo que voy a pedir un camarón, <laughs> un taco de camarón okay. y una tostada. Solo no un camarón. Es not hungry. <laughs> oh, un cóctel. Oh, un cóctel. Oh, okay. So let's try this out. Mm -hmm. Pero necesito, necesita uh, limón. Sí. Wow, look what she got. Let's see the review. <laughs> oh my. Rico or what? I, I don't know. I don't try. Okay, vamos. La tostada es extraña, miren. Nunca he visto una tostada. Let's try, let's see. Hey, when the babies are screaming you know it's gonna be good the kids will the parents will sit, sit through that like me or what <laughs> yeah oh I think we got our tacos coming up too okay yes pulpo wow pulpo y camarón that looks good oh my god I got two de camarón y un de marlin oh baby I don't know put a little hot sauce on it that's about it right how is it it's good, good? it's good okay. I love it all right First, oh my god, bro. These, these are fat. Ready? <laughs> Get that. Take a look at that. 10 de 10. Look at that camarón, see it? Yes. Come on, far. And look what we found. Who is that? Right here in the front, right here in the corner. That's the corner of the US in Tijuana. But uh, we're leaving here now. It was a great little trip. I think it's, I think um, Playa de Tijuana is cool, maybe like, you know, a couple times a year. <laughs> maybe, if, maybe if it's super nice, <laughs> I don't know. Who knows? But Okay, in conclusion, we are done with Playas de Tijuana. We spent maybe, what, two hours there? I think it was pretty fun, it was pretty cool. Windy day, but still a nice day. What are your thoughts? How, how often do you want to go there? I think maybe once every couple of months, maybe once a quarter is cool, or what? Yeah? Yeah? How often do you like to go there? ¿Cuántas veces por año quieres ir a Playas? One for a year. One time per year. Okay, yeah. that sounds about right to me too. Unless it's some kind of special event, but I know I will be going to Rosarito next weekend, so más contenido llegando pronto. Uh, Ryan Castro, say bye. Bye. Bye bye. That was Playas I'm tired. de Tijuana. Whatever you, hey, if you guys want anything, throw it in the comments. I will do everything for cheap. <laughs> yes. For cheap. <laughs>